Might I offer you some assistance? Where are you headed? I'm headed to London by way of Gladbury. It's the Christmas season, the whole town's in a fuss. Is it really so bad? It is, especially this Christmas with the new minister, high and mighty from London. Reverend high and mighty at your service. Welcome to Gladbury, home of the Christmas candle. Forgive my ignorance, but what is this Christmas candle? The Christmas candle's no different than old wives' tales or your Bible stories. Somebody's miracle is in this basket, and we won't let it go to waste. I'm praying for a husband by Easter. All their hopes wrapped up in one candle. It's high time that Gladbury see the light. You may have one candle to give, but I hope to give everyone a little light this Christmas. Electricity in the church. <laughs> now this I have to see. What is this light? Is it signs and wonders, angels and miracles? Of course not. Today marks the dawning of a new age. I'm not the miracle man that you remember. Your doubts don't trouble me, Reverend. On the contrary, they inspire my faith. Gentle folks of Gladbury, welcome to this very special night. The love I shared, the hope I had. Some things, they cannot be restored. I do hope you're wrong. I think you should stay just until Christmas. People need hope and you can give it to them. You really do want to help these people, don't you? Of course I do. I know just the person to give the candle to this year. A miracle is happening. It'll be a happy Christmas after all. <laughs>